there's going to be sacrifices that you're going to have to make when following Christ. And one of them is being able to let go. We got some packing to do. Only packing I'm really doing is what, what goes in here. Number one, this is like my number one priority. Letting go of your past, your relationships, old ways of how you used to do things that were bringing you results, but now they're a little bit stagnant because God has called you into something bigger, something that aligns more with His will. You see, each and every season is unique. God has it set for a specific purpose because He wants to develop something in you so that you can be prepared and that you can carry on His purpose that He has for you in the future. Now, part of being able to embrace the process that He has you in means you have to let go of what happened before. It's time for a haircut. I don't know what it's gonna be. I'm putting my trust in my barber though. Shout out my barber, man. Come on now. Isaiah chapter 43, verse 18 to 19. Forget the former things. Do not dwell on the past. See, I am doing a new thing. Now it springs up. Every single experience you face in life is unique. And there's something to take away from it. It's not simply experiences you face and then you're like, oh cool, I did that, cool, I faced that. You see, when we follow God, it's not for the sake of Him just controlling us and that His way is only the best way. His way is only the best way because He's protecting us from all the other ways that are going to harm us. When we follow God and His purpose, we are able to fully be ourselves because God is going to use every single ounce of our gifts, of our talents, of everything that He has created us to be to fulfill that purpose. You don't got to worry about being somebody else. You don't got to worry about what you're going to say, how you're going to think with me in these videos. I don't even got to think about how I'm supposed to speak. All of this is just natural because God has planted this in me. All glory to God. Isaiah chapter 55 verse 8 to 9. For my thoughts are not your thoughts, neither are your ways my ways, declares the Lord. As the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, and my thoughts than your thoughts. How do you let go? Keep seeking God, keep praying to Him, and follow His commandments. Amen.